Hello, good evening, um, Honorable, or, I mean, Johnson, Asiru Nketia. Thank you very much, and good evening to listeners. Yes, I, I'm, I'm sure the listeners are happy having you <laughs> in the studio because a number of issues have come up concerning the NDC and, and its recent comments on, on certain matters. But we want to delve straight into the issue of the referendum because that's most topical. Yeah. Um, the, the government, for example, uh, feels that your action, they called it a U-10, you know, was in bad faith because all along it appeared you were flowing with them, you attended stakeholder meetings, and, and you were happy with the process. For them to be hit all of a sudden with this U-10. Well, thank you very much. I would have been um, interested in finding out what effort or what event the government has ever organized or the MPP has ever organized to seek to seek our views, consult us about this referendum. Not a single one of uh, them. Are you, are, you, are you saying that we, we comments by the Minister for Local Government uh, that there were stakeholder engagements of which you attended some of the meetings? By whom? Of course, maybe the government or the ministry. Government has that, not... Uh, I haven't attended any stakeholder it, it could event be CSO, organized by it government. It could have been organized by CSO or so other CSO institutions. CSO is inviting me. And government people the who are there. Please. They have invited me, they have invited government. But for you to come out to say that we have consulted him, it's a wrong premise to begin with. Government has not consulted NDC on anything about this referendum. And that is a fact. And I'm surprised that the limited air time they have, instead of deploying it to campaign for years and raise the issues to convince people, they are all over the place, uh, you know, blaming people here and there. Are they saying that without us, they, they by themselves cannot raise cogent arguments to convince the electorates that the path they have chosen is a good path? Yes, I think they're trying to do that, but it appears... They I mean, are not doing it. No, they are you, always saying that. You, 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 have, you have a large following, people. and, and yes. this is, you know, a 75%, yes. you know, of the turnout vote sure. we want. 40% mm. turnout, mm. 75% of mm. that 40 percent yeah and so your inclusion or your agreement to be in line with mm -hmm. a certain position is mm -hmm. important but talking about consultation but, the minister said on this program mm -hmm. yesterday mm -hmm. that president akufuado consulted former president mahama on this same matter so and, why and, are you and, calling and, me and saying no, that and, I and, he appeared, <laughs> no, no and, and he appeared to to have agreed to the position that election of mmdcs and the local level on election what, should be partisan on what occasion and at what event and at what time? No, but we, we they, they, they recently, or the they few months ago, had a meeting. I mean, the former presidents met with the president at the Flagstaff House or the Jubilee House. They, they had engagements. There was, there was a, a, you know, a television coverage about it. We never heard about no, no, it. We, we didn't, television didn't cover the discussion. Please, I cannot uh, peep into private discussions. We are talking about... A referendum which should not be a private discussion mm. we are talking about a referendum and if you want to engage us you know how to engage us mm. and i'm telling you that nobody either in government or as a party on no occasion has anybody engaged us and so the, the earlier they stopped beating about the bush the better it will be because you know this is a party and a government that is not interested in engaging the other side at all. Mm. They choose to do what they want to do. And about you can go to hell if you choose. That's what their attitude has been. Having, were you not here when we were seeking to engage them to, to, to if, if you like, straighten things about the national identification? Did they budge? Were they not here when we were talking about limited voter registration? And we said that, look, Electoral Commission is saying they are preparing to register 300,000 people. The statistics they indicate that there are, uh, you know, 1.7 million people qualified to register. And yet they are insisting on this. Can we meet and straighten this? In? Did they budge? So, so what you, are you so talking you, so about? So you see this they, as an opportunity to pay them back? It is not about paying back. I'm establishing the fact that they are not a group that is interested in engaging anybody. Hmm. So don't let them come and be telling stories about we engaging and uh, are never able to tell us on what occasion they engage us, at what time, and what venue. They will not be able to talk about it. And I, I feel disappointed in the, in the media people they meet. Because mm. if somebody is alleging that 
uh, there's a backstabbing. We did this meeting, we reached this agreement. You know better. You know how to probe to find out whether they are lying to you or they are speaking the truth. And yet you ignore that one and you call us and you are asking us, are we backstabbing them? If all the media would do in the, uh, in the democracy is just to listen to people without doing any minimum uh, checks and then we'll carry whatever they have said as if it's a pipeline to another side and then we also give our side, then no cross-checking, then you go and give it to the other side, then uh, I'm afraid uh, we, are, we, are, we are doing something but short about, of uh, yes, our role in yes, democracy. Very well. I, think I want point, you mm -hmm. to find out from either the minister, John Buadu, or President Akufuado, mm. to tell us that we engage NDC on this serious matter of decentralization. These were the meetings we held at these venues at this time. Mm. And that these were the conclusions we reached. Mm. Then, if you bring us that information and you want us to react, we will then react. Oh, so far, nobody, all the media engagement people have, uh, you know, sought to do with me. Nobody is able to tell me that the people are saying they engage you at this venue, at this point, or at this date. Mm. Nobody, not a single one. Very well. But you agree that. Or will you agree that mm -hmm. there were other meetings you both attended, yes. organized by other institutions? Yes. yes. And at those fora, you yes. spoke almost the same language. Is that correct? I have spoken in various languages. And there was a point where <laughs> I appear to be uh, supporting the idea. Mm -hmm. But these are, you know, the beauty of democracy. Is that you can change your mind as there and when are you please. Clashes, uh, you know, clashes of of opinion from which sparks of truth emanate because otherwise why should there be democracy mm. when you go to parliament and you are beginning a debate everybody comes from the background with which and the ideas they bring on board it is out of the debate mm. that you come to draw conclusions it is unfortunate that MPP when they decided to do this and they knew very well that they alone maybe are by their own ways they cannot govern the 75 percent and therefore they needed everybody mm. wouldn't it have been better in the national interest to come seek engagement we sit together explore the issues together look at the constitution because there everything that the constitution has provided in one clause has roots in other areas mm. so if we just pick one article of the constitution and you think that it covers local government so when i amend it then i'm uh, uh, bingo i'm there you are wrong very well so this uh, you know introduction of multi-party system in uh, local government it is a separate subject from the the issue about whether this is should be elected or not very well so, and so, so, now, so the let, president let, 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 and the party yes. sought to you know, confuse the issues. Very well.